my new project for power theft controlling okay first I'll let you introduce what are the things are going on this project um, there are two uh, basic uh, kit for microcontroller section uh, this one is meter where we consuming a light this is a pulse uh, uh, that thing is indicating how much we are getting a pulse uh, from loading our operations or how much load is uh, the thing is being taken by a meter okay uh, this is nothing but I am using a 555 timer uh, with the S table mode and I have fixed uh, some value by these with having a 1 or 2 hertz of frequency and uh, by this you can change their uh, uh, speed of pulses like I'll go this uh, a bit faster or not okay. uh, now you can see the pulse are getting faster so you can control the pulse by changing a load load means resistance this one is resistance you can change the pulse of the uh, stable output of 555 timers okay now this thing is uh, gone directly goes to uh, the output of these pulses from LED and also from these uh, connector and this thing is gone through a switch where we can redirect a meter by main line or uh, from meter okay 2 meter uh, is uh, from where the line is coming and directly I can attach my load to uh, uh, the main wire but uh, okay. okay now uh, the pulse output from this wire is given by uh, this switch L means uh, L means uh, through loss loss in connection means uh, there is a theft between or the line is redirected to uh, the main load and the main wire there is no contribution of motor, uh, sorry, motor, uh, meter. There is no contribution of meter in between, and this is a normal. So, uh, just have to uh, for a very initial startup, I have to switch off both of the things, both of the microcontrollers. Then I switch on. side so you can see the loss 001 and there is uh, no change in client side meter and also a uh, reading through this RS232 or PLCC power line carrier communication control there is no uh, communication is sent because uh, the thing is redirected okay and when I go for a normal mode now you can see uh, the losses are 31 and 7 consumer is using uh, this much of pulses and same here 14 16 17 18 20 so both are synchronized because uh, these uh, normal pulses are governed by this RS232 communication. So there is no loss between. Here the thing is redirected in a loss section. So again you can see the pulses of loss is continuously increased. If you can take this wire, the, it will show continuously this loss in wire. 
and here you can see the red LED, green LED is now still working. The load is connected. If the loss is nearby uh, uh, 100, then it will give the signal by RS232 to this um, meter, client meter, to switch off or disconnect from a main supply. So there will be no connection provided to the customer that he can use and uh, there is one more uh, you can see there is two LED this one is red and this one is green so whenever a green LED is connected it means the thing is connected to power supply and if you go for uh, if the red LED is uh, glowing then it means uh, uh, the power is disconnected from meter or a main supply so consumer is using a continuous uh, the pulses or a load and it will show the losses so losses this is a main meter that is a nearby a transformer or by a big, uh, power department okay so when the thing is 100 the fault detected and reset system uh, all this uh, uh, this meter where the main meter it is nearby a transformer or a power determinant uh, uh, this thing is locked still is locked and the consumer meter this thing is also lost uh, lost uh, uh, locked sorry not locked <laughs> uh, the consumer meter is also locked so you can't change anything so this one is red LED uh, or yellow I am taking a yellow so uh, this means the communication of uh, the meter and the main meter is lost and it will switch off the bulb switch off the load okay Ciao. thank you Now the components inside the basic kit is this one is power socket and DPDT switch for switch on the circuitry this one is bridge rectifier to convert AC into DC you can both use AC and DC supply of 1 ampere or a 500 milliampere to operate this kit this one is a 5 volt regulator and LED for indication this one is filter when the DC is converted it will filter the circuits and these uh, connector if you want to take out some like uh, I have taken a connection of this wire from there so same as like in uh, this controller this one is 5 volt of supply this one is ground and this one is 12 volt of supply and this one is 12 volt regulator if you want to operate some of the motor like having a 12 volt rating you can operate or a device whatever that can be a relay motor some uh, uh, electronic circuit that governed by a 12 volt so these are uh, L type uh, strip connector where you can connect uh, the device with the port 2 and port 0 this one with having a some uh, supply ground uh, terminals also and with having a some uh, pull up network resistance to pull up the current of uh, mm, uh, the device if you want to connect it or this one is reset switch to reset the complete microcontroller this one is for checking a debouncing state when I switch on the uh, that thing my uh, micro switch or uh, this is the indication when I switch on you can have a look when I press this button, it will switch on the LED. Okay, uh, these strips are for uh, programming a microcontroller by external ISP inline serial programming with uh, having some terminals inside the MISO or like that. You can connect these uh, to microcontroller or directly program to this thumbprint without any uh, universal program ever. Uh, 
switches for a selection a running mode and a programming mode if the thing is switch off the thing is in uh, programming mode if the thing is switch on the thing is this six circuit is in running mode so uh, I got the last uh, I switch off switch on welcome to blah blah something was it but blah blah but I didn't change I go for neutral normal so both are having the same uh, circuit or microcontroller but I have taken this RS-232 communication for uh, governing of PLC power line uh, carrier communication in between you can use a power line modem to communicate directly with the supply this thing is connected to uh, RCB board or main transform where you are taking a power supply from and this one is client side meter so 